Hey everyone, Dan from On One here. I wanted to talk to you a little bit about keywords and the new master keyword list in Photo Raw 2019. It lives right here underneath the metadata pane. It's rolled up by default. You can click it to roll it down and it'll show you all of the keywords that you've ever added to a photo or there for every photo you've ever browsed the keywords that are on them. And for the current view that you're looking at, it'll even count how many photos in the current view have certain keywords. That keyword list can be really long. That's why we give you a search field at the top. Now I'm going to give you kind of a real world scenario. I like to go to Lake Tahoe and take a lot of pictures there. It's one of my favorite shooting locations. But until recently, I always thought of Lake Tahoe as being California. But if you look at it on the map, in reality, it's half in Nevada and half in California. And I realized that the side that I shoot on all the time is actually the Nevada side of the lake. So I actually have the wrong keyword on all of my Lake Tahoe pictures. So let me show you how to fix that. I'm going to go to my search field and I'll just type in Lake Tahoe. You notice as I start to type it in, it's going to automatically narrow down my keyword list. And if I double click on it, it will go out and find all of the photos in my collection that have the Lake Tahoe keyword attached to them. If you right click, you can also do the same thing. Notice it says find catalog photos with this keyword. That's the same thing as double clicking. So there we go. It's gone out. It searched through all of my photos and it's come back with 374 photos that are shot at Lake Tahoe. And now I can just select all of these guys and I'll change my keyword list to look for California instead. So as I start to type that in, it narrows the list down. There's California. I don't want the keyword California, so I can just right click and select remove keyword from selected photos. There we go. Now that keyword is gone. Now I want to add the keyword Nevada. So again, from that search field, I'll just type in what I'm looking for. It'll narrow it down. There's Nevada. I can just click right on the little dot right here to add or remove. Or again, if I right click, I can select assign keyword to selected photos. There we go. Now I've swapped keywords. Everything that was from Lake Tahoe that said California now says Nevada. You know, I noticed another mistake while I was here. I called it Salt Harbor. It's not Salt Harbor, it's Sand Harbor. So I can also use the master keyword list to fix keywords that I spelled incorrectly. So I'll just type in salt. And as I type that in, there we go. There's Salt Harbor. I'm just going to select that keyword, right click and say edit. And now I can fix by spelling mistake. There we go. Same thing. It goes out, finds all those photos with the wrong keyword and corrects it to the correct spelling. If I already have that keyword, it'll just merge the two keywords together. So if I had Salt Harbor and Sand Harbor, everything would just become Sand Harbor. You can also use the master keyword list to remove keywords completely from your collection. If it's one I don't want to use, I can right click and select delete keyword and it will remove that keyword from your master keyword list and it'll find any photos that have that keyword and remove that keyword from them as well. The master keyword list is a new and really powerful way to find your photos, to add metadata, and to correct metadata mistakes. Thanks for watching.